What is going on guys? I am the white guy. Today we are playing some more MX versus A2E Reflex as um, seems to be par for the course of this channel again here trying to get it going again. This is a Vanguard Supercross round 3 made by Nick the Lion. He says this is the final round at the stadium and it's one of his last Supercross tracks. He said there's an unpleasant contact with the bale and big thanks to Dark Slides in the um, description on Reflex Central over there. Um, yeah, this is a this is another interesting little track. He's made a few of these. I think I've made videos about the uh, other Vanguard S Supercross tracks that he's made. It's a very it's an interesting track. I, I, they usually tend to be interesting. The, the thumbnail on Reflex Central looks very tempting. So it's like, oh, we got to give that one a shot. And uh, yeah, makes mostly we're gonna try and uh, I found about six more tracks in the course of the last 20 minutes. I've apparently been put up. We're, we're trying to make some more Reflex videos. I'm gonna try and get ahead of the game so we can keep releasing some semi daily Reflex uploads. Uh, I think right now the upload schedule I'm planning on is going to be like Reflex one day, spin tires the next day, then Reflex, then spin tires, and like alternate back and forth between them for a bit, because that seems to be what, um, what I'm able to find content for, and then depending on, let me know if you guys want to see it in the comments, but I, I have the full game of Steep, I, I did cave and buy the full game of that, so I can, can do some more videos of Steep, I know there's just like some DLC update that just got put out that, uh, we can do that, or we can do some more snow. Just in general, let me know if there's anything you guys want to see. I'd assume you're already going to say, Let, let's keep going with Reflex, and I'll keep that up. But if there's anything specific you guys want to see, let me know. As for some, some other updates on stuff, um, there's no more snow, so snowmobiling is done until the 2018 season. And uh, the dirt bike is currently sitting in a garage in a bunch of pieces right now because the things like to break them. Um, I took it apart and like, oh, I'll just clean the carb out, see if it runs a bit better, because I may or may not have to do a top-end rebuild, and if cleaning the carb will make it, it will help, but if that's the problem, it'll be nice, so I don't have to do a top-end rebuild, because I don't, because uh, the current budget is not allowing for top-end rebuilds to happen, and I, I, I really don't want to do it if I don't have to. But, um, yeah, I tried that, and then uh, I lost a couple screws in that that I had to go buy, I lost a couple bolts taking the subframe off that I had to go buy, and then, uh, of all the things, that little rubber boot that goes over the spark plug, but, you know, you know, you get your spark plug in the cylinder, and there's that little rubber bit that goes over and covers the spark plug and makes connection to the ignition coil. Um, yeah, that, that little piece of rubber decided to break, in t break like, into two separate pieces, so I'd order a new one of those off of Motorsport. And apparently it's a, it's a $40, the little tiny thing of rubber is $40 for a new one, and it's not going to be here for a few more days, so the bike's out of commission. Um, due to budgeting concerns, uh, got guns are currently, um, I've, I've got a little bit of ammo sitting around here as it's just trying to chillin', but I, I can't really afford to buy more ammo due to budgetary concerns of vehicles that need to be bought in the near, very near future. So, uh, yeah, in, in that in that sense of the word, especially with all the whole YouTube, just kind of the, like a, this, the CPMs I mentioned before, I, I just checked this before I started recording this video. I used to be able to get like a dollar, a dollar, two dollar CPMs, and now I'm getting like eight cents on a CPM. So it's, yeah, it's a... Uh, not, not where it used to be, so right? <laughs> it's not, not not very ideal, so with with the whole YouTube thing not really being able to fund new investments into the, that could produce content for the channel, a lot of projects are kind of being put on hold, and you budgetary concerns, some things may or may not be happening now. But um, we'll, I'll do the best I can. Hopefully I can get the bike fixed for cheap, because if, if, if that thing comes out, there shouldn't be too much to get put back together, and hopefully it'll run fine. And uh, we, can, we can hope for the best on that front, but uh, lots of other things are probably going to be put on hold for now, right? Especially, yeah, but budget budget sucks, okay? Living is expensive, and like, things, things like to not function well for you, and yeah. We're, we're, I'm trying my best to we'll, we'll try and make some ends meet here and see if we can do anything interesting in the future, but yeah, but budget constraints aren't fun. Anyway, this this track here is very, very interesting. We've got a nice little finish line jump right there. Let's see if we can get, I want to see if we can get like a minute five or something like that for a very good target lap time. We'll scrub that off. And this is a wall, but of course we're just going to send it. And, ooh, we just barely missed downsiding that whip right there. That is incredibly unfortunate. That would have been a lot smoother to be able to make it. Now, now we're shooting off the side of the track and crashing because this lap is just going down the toilet very quickly. All right, let's see if we can just like uh, I bet we can do a back whip over one of these. Oop, nope, not quite. That wasn't the. I, try, I was trying to go for the backflip glitch and ended up doing a 360 instead. So that's that's all in good fun. Uh, we'll just have to double, double, double. There we go. And then let's get to this corner here. Step on, step off, wheelie over it, and we're back off again. Dragon's back. Tried up. Oh, tried to use the tough block to assist enough. 
assist in the turning there, but tough tough block assist the turning did not want to happen, unfortunately. So we have to double, we're going to have to double this, and then we'll just double, triple out. Yes, what sort of, all right. Get to throw a bit of a whip glitch to get that triple in. A little bit more to get this triple in. Oh, it was just about the right length to be able to clear them with the, the current bike setup I've got going on right now. All right, we're going to tap over that. There we go. Cut around the corner. There we go. And finish line triple. 126. That's, a, that's just an atrocious time. Let's try and get one more in here. Scrub. A little bit of a whip glitch. And corner. Let's just not launch the wall this time. And see if we get a better line through the whoops here. Yes, not launching the wall did work out a little bit better. Uh, going to overjump that quite a bit. And we're going to case that quite a bit, and then we're probably not even going to come close to making that triple because of that. So let's just check ourselves up here, pick some speed up so we can start hitting things again. Triple, triple. Nice. Let off the gas just a little bit to make that corner a little bit smoother. Step on, step off. Step on, step off. Get to the corner. Up the drag. There we go. That's, that's what we need to do. Triple, and triple out. Thank you. And I like these little bumps up into the corners. Those are probably, I like those. Those are neat. And we're probably not going to clear that because we botched that corner pretty badly. Oh, didn't quite get the, um, the whip glitch we needed to be able to double that. So we'll just have to settle down for that and scoot over and tire tap. Double, thank you, and double out. There we go. And I want to see if we can back up the finish line triple here. We should be able to if we get the glitch going. Oh, we tried to cut left after the backflip, and it did not want it to happen. That's unfortunate. All right, let's try and let's, let's go again here. Let's try and actually hit all the rhythms. So we're going to do a mild tactical tire tap there. Scrub over the wall a little bit if we can. Let's try to get through the whoops in a good way. And whip, don't whip glitch that. Just, just no, don't need to. Do need to whip glitch that one. And probably going to come up a little short here. That's unfortunate, but if we ride the berm all the way out wide, we can pick the speed back up, and then use a bit of a whip glitch to get ourselves going again. And there we go, step on, step off, on, off, corner. There we go, that's a tough block assist of turning we were looking for in the past. Hopefully get that triple, there we go, hopefully get this triple, yes, and just a little bump out into the corner there. Keep the speed up. That's yep. Yeah, that's what you need to rail that rut. Uh, that rail that berm just right, and you get all the speed you need. There we go. And you can triple, triple, double scrub. Yes, that worked out well. And here we go. Let's go for one actual like serious attempt at a lap right now. Cut left immediately after landing that, and triple into the corner. Cut off the gas a little bit. Break for the wall. Didn't get on the brakes early enough. So we may struggle through this whip section a bit. Nope. And, oh yeah, we don't need to whip glitch that. That's very easy to make a jump after that. All right. Let's just uh, settle down and just double this right now to save a little bit of time. And just launch into the corner. There we go. And we shouldn't need to whip glitch either of these too hard. We should have good rhythm. There we go. Keep it going. Step on. Step off. Bump up. Drop down. And that was an all right corner there. I wouldn't, probably couldn't do that again if I tried to, but it worked. And triple, triple. There we go. Double into the corner. That's, there we go. That's a good, that's a good line. Don't need to whip glitch that triple super hard if we rail the corner correctly. And tactically, ta tactically placed tire tap out of that. So you're going to triple, triple, double out. Let off the gas way too much for the double out. And I, I'll try it back at this finish line. All right, now let's try and do an actual lap after we back at the finish line. <laughs> okay, we, we shouldn't lose too much time on that. We should be able to still beat a 112 if we do everything else just right. Which, unfortunately, is apparently not going to happen, so we launched the wall a little bit too hard right there. I do say so myself. So we are probably going to be heavily reliant upon whatever little mini whip which we can use right there to get over that. Did clear that though, and you shouldn't be able to get that triple. There we go. Okay, this is actually looking better now. Oh, just when it's looking better, of course, we have to do some tactical tire tapping out. 
And can we get this section correct? We see step on, step off, step on, bump off, let off the gas from the corner. Into the, yep, there we go. That's that's how you do that section correctly. Don't need to hit that super hard or that. We can just kind of float on over. Drop down, get the corner right. There we go. Didn't need to whip glitch that at all. Shouldn't have, because now we're going to be out of rhythm. Ugh. There's an atrocious line right there. But we can use that little bump up right there to save ourselves if we're not going to make that triple. And we're not going to beat the 112, are we? No, we are not. All right. So let's try this one more time now. We're actually going to finish all the laps in the video for a change. How about that? We us I usually set the laps way higher. Don't even come close to finishing all of them. But I think I might actually get through all of these in the video. That's uh, That'd be a first for a while. So we have to let out, get on the brakes really early for that wall there. Get it going through here. Whip over, please. Don't crash. There we go. And triple scrub that a little bit. Keep it a little lower. And triple, triple. Thank you. There we go. Cut to the right, cut to the right. Step on. Step off, on, off, off the gas. Gas hard and the dragon's back. Don't need to hit that one super hard. Don't need to whip glitch either of these. There we go. And if we rail this corner correctly, should yeah, we're gonna need to whip glitch to assist us over this one. <sighs> so close. Every, every time. Like I'm so close to getting that just right. And the game just decides, nah, that's not that's not about to happen. It just that just doesn't like to function, apparently. Alright, so let's get back over through this section as sloppily as we can. And we actually still might have a chance of beating the 112.75 there. Nope, so close, but not not even if I tried a little bit harder, we could have beat it. This lap, though, I do want to try and I will actually put forth effort even if we screw up. So we can't have one big screw up and then still be able to get across the line in time, it looks like. So let's see, 12.75 is the time to beat. Can we do it? I think if I get forth the best effort, this should be doable, but um, yeah, with this kind of a line, it's not going to be doable, I don't think. I'll still try, though. We'll try try our best. No, no, there's no way this is happening. Alright, that, that, that lap's just gone, gone horribly south really quickly. Unless I just nail everything else perfectly and way faster than I've been it before, there's just no way this is going to work out, but with uh, there might be a chance. There's a chance. A small chance. The way this is going, if we can hit this corner just right and actually get a good rhythm through here. There's a chance. Yes! Come on, make it! Oh, there is a chance. There is a chance. Probably not going to happen, though, because we have less than... <laughs> yeah, no way. <sighs> Dang it. Oh, wait a minute. Oh! Oh! We, yeah, we still beat it. Yeah! But that's about going to have to do it for this video, guys. Thank you very much if you watched this far. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Let me know what you want to see in the future. If you want to see any other reflex, like steep or spin tires or whatnot. Thanks for watching. If you made it this far, if you're new, hopefully you subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one.